it is. But do not let her cruelty unnerve you. We must stop her, no matter what. <sighs> this feeling, for the first time, it feels like my fate is in my own hands. And with these very hands, I will crush you. You're crazy. You have brought forth your own destruction. You're just like Father. You always think you know better, but I am no fool. Unlike him, I am aware of the consequences of my own actions. My new body won't be able to contain this power for long. But long enough to put an end to everything, starting with you!
ever want. We'll bring forth the sources of souls. Then we're running out of time.
shall use it to our advantage.
Sierra of this alive. He will have lots to answer for. One mistake, and you'll finally be dead.
Judge, forgive me. What happened? My head hurts and spins in equal measure. Ah, ah. Briar! Loot! Is it you? It happened again. Yes. But do not worry for us, Nathan. Not for now, at least. How do you feel? Do you remember? The last thing I recall was Donovan making his way to the relic. Poor soul. I can't but feel pity for him. And even for his daughter. Anyway, then came a blast and I blacked out. I suppose that's when you... Transcended? Yes. Eventually. Once Hannah gave in to the destruction within her, we had no other choice. Between death and transcendence, a chimera chooses death. Those sounded like wise words. At the time, it looks like I was the fool. But the dare, the dare is no more. How did you seal it? We didn't exactly seal it. We drained the relic of its power. So that now, that power lies within you. This fool. Our corrupted blood must be helping us contain it. We do not know exactly how, or for how long, or what would happen should we turn back to our previous selves. The situation is dire, and the danger is great. Yet again, what you did, I can't but thank the Keepers for... No. I have to thank you for it. So what do you propose? What course of action should we take now? Hide. Survive. Try to... adapt to this new condition of yours. While you draw breath, there is still hope for this world and for Dougal's plan to be thwarted. The two things are strictly related. As for me, I will send word to Rhyme. I will set up my stage once more. They shall be surprised to see that I still stand. Or simply disappointed. Won't it be dangerous for you? They would come for me anyway. I'd rather be their first target, instead of you. I can buy you some time. If things go my way, I may even be able to help you.
but I can't make any promises. At least promise that you'll be careful. I will. May the Keepers watch over you, my friends. What are you doing here? I thought I'd never see you again. The torchbearer led you back to me at a most convenient time. I have a very important message for you to deliver. There you go now. To rhyme. for a corrupted creature, and my instinct got the best of me. After all, who could roam these ruins, if not one that carries their taint? You must have a good reason to be here, alive. Cordelia? Cordelia the Reaper? I'm... Sorry, my lady, but the chimeras that came before you, they're no more. I'm afraid you're too late. Or maybe I was right on time. What lies did you write in that letter? Where are they? Don't be so reckless, my sweet reaper. Once the Torchbearer takes them, the dead can only tell us so much. I will have a friendly conversation with our devoted observer. While you give chase to Briar and Loot. They won't stand a chance, Your Grace. <laughs> Approach them with that attitude, and you'll face the judge in no time. It's not time yet. Follow them. Learn what they're capable of. Then report back to me. As your grace commands. So, Leighton, I assume your letter was addressed to me. Speak then. What did you wish to tell the Grand Master of the Ashen Blade? You know that you were meant to die here, with all the others. 
Did you expect that I would fall for any of your pretentious tales? Let us speak the truth for once, then. They stopped you, Dougal. Admit it. The outcasts did what no one believed possible, including me. Those peasants did exceed my expectations, yes. But all they have accomplished is just a small setback. A detour from a path that cannot be abandoned. But why? What did you hope to accomplish here? You would not understand, or anyone else in your sanctimonious triarchy. But you do not need to. It suffices that you recite your beloved canticle. The three cities still stand to this day for the glory of the Keepers. Are those tears of Adoran and Rhyme? Dougal, you madman! What have you done? The solstice of souls is upon us.